um, bonus season in the finance industry is projected to go in two directions, with bankers at regional U.S. lenders hurt by smaller incentive pools, while year-end compensation at larger and firms is expected to rise by double digits. Um, bankers working for regional firms are likely to see their bonuses um, decline as much as 20% this year, uh, while their counterparts, uh, major global banks, could see um, their incentive to pay increase as much as 20%, um, according to a report Tuesday that gave an early projection for the year from uh, compensation consultant Johnson Associates, Inc. We have the have and have nots. Big banks are doing great. Small banks are suffering. Uh, Alan Johnson, managing director of Johnson Associates, said in an interview uh, that will impact how bankers are paid at year end uh, when bonuses are calculated based on performance. Uh, he said on um, the first quarter, banking giants including J.P. Morgan Chase and Company and Citigroup in court reeled and windfalls from higher interest rates. Uh, those benefits uh, contrasted with the experience at regional banks uh, that saw a flood of withdrawals uh, and precipitous stock drops as shareholders uh, worried uh, that rising rates were eroding the value of the firm's assets. Last year, the average Wall Street bonus plunged 26% as a slump in deal-making and banks efforts to contain costs weighed on compensation, according to an analysis by New Point York State Comptroller Thomas Dinopoli. That percentage brought the average bonus closer to what employees received before the COVID-19 pandemic, he said. Uh, bankers who advise on mergers and acquisitions also are likely to see their bonuses decline as much as 20% this year, while their counterparts in debt underwriting are poised to fare better with uh, their incentive pay increasing 5% to 10%, uh, according to the, the Johnson Associates report. At the five biggest Wall Street firms, investment banking revenue fell 23% in the first three months of the year. Inflation, fears of a recession, and wild market swings kept deal-making, including initial public offerings, this thing muted. The battle for talent has also slowed in the finance sector, with some firms tripping headcount and freezing hiring to manage expenses. Uh, people are more cautious on hiring, uh, and firms have uh, cut back significantly uh, with, with headcount flat uh, to trending down, Johnson said. Uh, there are some signs of bright spots in the industry, especially for desks that continue to benefit from rising interest rates um, and the move away from equities uh, to lower risk assets, such as bonds or money market funds. Um, fixed income traders could see um, their bonuses increase as much as 15%, outperforming their equity trading peers as IPO activity remains muted, according to the report. Um, elsewhere in finance, incentive pay is likely to be flatter down. Those working in asset management may see a decline of 10% on lower profits, while well, bonuses at a wealth management firms are projected to be flat to up 5%, Johnson Associates said. Similarly, at private equity firms, both big and small,